Okay, in this video, we'll see how to use meta tags in Angular 18. So, we'll see how to include meta tags like title, description, then the main title, and how to update them. So, if you if I go ahead and show you here, this is the site where I have added those meta tags. Okay, so if I say Control U, so you can see I have meta help tags here that is giving to help a uh, user dashboard so these are these are dynamic tags that are appearing from the application so how do we include this uh, we'll see how to include these tags okay so this is important for our uh, seo and uh, whenever we make the site live so the search crawlers crawl the website and based on the meta tags it will rank our website so this is a very important topic as it helps to rank a website and our visibility on the search engines. So to do this, let's go to the code. And uh, what we need to do is we need to include the Angular platform uh, services. So, so this is the thing that we need to include. So this is the user dashboard that I had created. So what I'll do is I will import this. Okay. So let me go to the organizers first, organize the dashboard. And here, okay, not here. So we can see here in the in this organizer dashboard. Wait, let me do this. So this is the user dashboard. So if I go to organizer dashboard, organizer dashboard, then we can see that we do not have this meta text that are dynamic. So we'll put here giving to help organizer dashboard and we'll include the other meta tags. So now if I go to the code, so I've included this. Now in the constructor, I need uh, this data here that is meta and the title service so i will go to my organizer dashboard organizer component and then include this okay so i'll include this but we have not included the we have not imported the browser platform so let's import the browser platform here okay so we have included this now on ng init we need to set this data so i'll go ahead here in the browser and i will copy this ng init okay and i will paste it here so this will be our organizer dashboard then also this i'll keep as organizer dashboard and welcome to or i'll keep some different message here organize dashboard then i'll say view total total events fund Razors and more. Okay, let me set this as the info, the meta info for this component for this page. So if I go ahead now and if I refresh this control URL, so we cannot see the changes appearing here. So let's, uh, okay. This is organizer, right? So organizer, organizer dashboard. Okay. We are still getting giving to help and the meta tags are not appearing. Uh, we'll see why this is happening. Okay, organizer dashboard. Actually, it should appear, but I don't know why it is not appearing. So if I okay, so if I go here, 
I am getting some error in the console, I think. Wait. Okay, so like I'll go here. Organizer dashboard. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm redirected back to the main page. So it's saying we cannot match this uh, URL segment. So let me check what is the URL segment uh, for this. Uh, app component will go to app routes organizers okay so i'll go here i'll see organizers and i'll see dashboard and you can see now that organizer dashboard is coming here if i hover the uh, if i hover over the tab you can see organizer dashboard here now let's go let's press Control u and we can see that the organizer dashboard title has been updated here so this is one of the coolest feature i like in angular that it allows to update you the meta tags very easily and you can see that the meta tags also here are updated so organizer dashboard meta description which we had put so everything is coming here so this is the simple way how you can uh, update the meta tags which are very important in the website so thanks for watching guys and please do like this video.